firms, everything you and I know is that basketball, it's a lot about having an advocate, right? And knowing no question. because it is a small world because you're going to get emails from kids, like you said, from all over the country. And, and there might be fine players that would be perfect fits for you no matter which program you're at. But if you got a buddy of yours or a contact of the program saying, hey, you really need to look at this kid, that verification is what a coach like you needed back in the day. Expl- explain more about that. Yeah, I mean, I, I I talk to coaches all the time, high school and college coaches, and, and I firmly believe that basketball is the hardest sport for a high school player to get to the next level. I think it's so hard to get to the college level in basketball because of all the different factors going on with the transfer portal, the one-time transfer rule, the COVID waiver rule, you know, different budget resources and cuts that are going, you know, across the board in a lot of small colleges. So I think it's really important for high school players to have someone in their corner that's knowledgeable, that understands the process, understands levels, and has connections to college coaches, helping them find opportunities. Because, you know, you know this, Corey, like colleges, coaches get flooded with emails from recruits every day. And most of them don't even read them. They don't even open them, you know? And so, but if it's from somebody they know and trust or a phone call, they get that somebody, then they're going to take that call and they're going to listen to that person. So I, I really think it's important in this day and age because of all the different challenges facing high school recruits that they have somebody that that's knowledgeable and, and that's connected and that can help them in their corner. 